Greetings, everyone! It is I, Kikoski, uh, welcoming you to the stream. The pre-stream, to be exact, where you have the opportunity to get here, get comfortable, and get it ready for day 484 of Hillsfar. Hello, Daffy! How are you doing? I hope you are doing well. Hope everything is going well. It has been all change over the last few days on Animal Crossing and also just in my life in general. It has been very, very busy, and very, very uncertain, and very odd, but such is the way that life sometimes goes. I hope things are good for all of you. Also, just be advised that the best tasting island is Hillsfar, because everything tastes great. Everything. Look at that burb. Hello there, Ogre! How are you doing today? I hope you're doing well. But but it's not just that burb anymore. The island is now an island of three burbs. We are now triple burb. Because we now have the Zort. We have the Qua, we have the Bazoot, and now we have the Zort. And he's a Robo-Bird. I actually just bought a frozen duck last night for a future supper. Well, it's not, it's not Weber, so that's okay. Look, look at that burb. It's a swell burb. It is a robo burb. Hello, G Vault. How are you doing today? I hope you are doing well. Hope things are going good. I almost feel like this should be the thumbnail, just a picture of getting swole. I mean, we're not bad at getting swole. Also, today is a day where I have to keep my phone open and on... just on and available and out, so that just in case I get a call, I have to take that call. It is a question of, I, I have to take the call. I don't expect it to be good news, but it's going to be news either way. I hope you're doing well, g Hobo, Ogre, Daffy. Hello, Specialist as well. How are you doing? Also, there he is. There's our buddy. Just, just being sat there. Honestly, this could be the thumbnail. I feel like this could be the thumbnail. Just... We just, uh, not Weber, but, uh, Marcel. Just being Marcel. Ah, yes, I do need to update that. Thanks for, uh, pointing that out to me. I do need to update it. Uh, there have been, as you can imagine, a lot of things on my mind. So, let us finally, finally remove Annalise from this list, and add Sprocket. There we go. Done. It is now up to date. I also need to go and get Marcel and Sprocket's posters. I know it, it's a sad thing that she is gone, but also we had a very very long time with her. A very long time. And I, I'm glad for the time I had. I'm glad for the time I had. Did you finally get her photo? Oh, yes. We finally did. In fact, I have the picture after getting her photo. Where is it? It was after Bree left, oddly. And then she was like, well, I've finally done it. I I've I've been sufficiently agitating. I shall now give up my photo and be yeeted through... Wait, wait, yeeted through a cannon? <laughs> there is no actual cannon. I shot my system games since I had mine hooked up for the first time. Oh, Ultima 4, that would be... That would be neat. Also, there you go. In the, uh... In the case... The, uh... Display cases... You have Yuka's photo. You have Kitty's photo. And 
And then you have Annalise's photo. The cannon is not cannon. I know it, it, it's not. Bizarre, what do you mean the cannon's not cannon? Oh, but I was planning on firing people out of it. I mean, not firing people out of it. I mean, firing myself out of it. Wait, no! And that's pretty much jitters in a nutshell. Also, there was this picture of him just being like... Wait, why haven't I ever gone into the airport? I came by the airport. Why have I never gone back in? Huh. There is also just the, the option of having that as the thumbnail, just... But honestly, Marcel needs a bit of limelight. Mar Marcel does need a bit of limelight. We're probably going to use the Marcel picture. Probably going to use that one. He's a nice doggo. He's a very nice dog. Just a very nice villager all round. Yeah, when they when they say to me, "Oh, we're definitely going to contact you," airport has a no bird policy. But dodos aren't birds; they are extinct. For the for those curious, I mean, yeah, they are extinct, but they also were birds. I mean, w we can't pretend that they were not birds. Also, hello, Alias. How are you doing? I hope you are doing well this day. <laughs> it's a good picture with Jitters peeking out from behind the trees. <laughs> A jitters. <laughs> it's like... And work meeting about to start, so time to turn to... That's fine! L lurk away. I'll tell you what, the uh, video about asking for ideas on things, that brought out a lot of people that lurk. Like, a lot of people that lurked commented. And that, that video has hundreds of comments. Hello, Tom Tom. If only all my videos had hundreds of comments. I thought to myself today, maybe I can get a bit of, you know, priming done of models. And then it went, nope. And then there was no opportunity to prime models. There was no opportunity at all. But that is not a bad thing, necessarily. Does Blathers know Dodos are extinct? And if so, does he wonder why extinct birds are right? Nah, I, I, I mean, he probably doesn't think about it, honestly. He's just like, oh, they're not extinct. There are two birds right there. Fun fact, maybe in the world of Animal Crossing, dodos aren't extinct. I mean, they're not, because you have Wilbur and Orville, so maybe the world of Animal Crossing is different, is distinct in that regard. I don't know. Tons of comments on these. No, no, the actual, like, really, really genuine comments. There were some lovely comments there, and lots of really good ideas as well. Lots of really good ideas. Like, things I was planning on implementing, other things I can consider. All these things will take time, and if the whole house thing happens, then, uh... It'll be, uh... What? Why? My mother there just being like, which one? And I'm like, it's, it's, it's two bedroom. Like I link, I linked it. I linked it to your, to my dad. I linked it to your partner. Ah. Oh. Hello there, Toby. Hey, heard you're getting uh, worried about houses and stuff. I mean. Yeah, we have uh, a mammoth as a villager, a, a dragon, robots. A, a duck that's a tomato, I mean. There's also an orange cat, I mean, we all know that the, the, the cat that is orange. You got your mofies, you yeah. 
and a phoenix. Hello there everyone! Right now on Hills Fans 2pm on Tuesday, November the 14th, 2023. This may not count as news, but I do have a cautionary tale of sorts to share. Occasionally residents complain that they purchased a bike of art only to realise that it's, well, fake. They all know that the fakes were purchased from a boat anchored along the northern shore. What you do with your bells is your business, but I ask you to please be wary of this boat. Stay vigilant. And with that, I'll get back to work supporting you and your enjoyment of our island. Thank you! You knew it, what you knew to be red today. You know what it isn't today, unlike in real life? It isn't raining. It isn't raining today on the island. Oh, I bought some things too. I bought a lot of things, potentially, for Sprocket's garden. There's a lot of stuff. I got my fake in the mail from Marshall. <laughs> Oh, no, no, don't, don't, I always, I always almost report myself. Do not report yourself. Don't start that rain dance. Fortunately, I think it's too sunny in, for it to be, uh, something like that. Cool sofa, cool side table, a pull-up bar stand, a protein shake bottle. Poor Kiko for spam, don't report me for spam. But I hope you're all doing well today. So, Dream Bell Exchange Ticket. There is an electric guitar. And a very fancy amp. And a throwback skull radio. And Margie being adorable, just have- uh, hang on. I'm contractually obligated to get an adorable picture of the sit. There we go. Contractual obligation secured. I, I, I can't not take a picture of that sit. That's adorable. Look, we see that contract? No. N no. Uh, yeah, no. Right. Let's sort out presents. We can only actually do eight presents today. So I think it's going to be oranges. And I think it's going to be three apiece. Every time I get a notification on my phone right now, it's just me immediately leaning over. Going, who is it? And it's like, no, it, it's not who you think it is, Kiko. 2D, can you bring oranges today? I need vitamin C. It's like, oh, it's all right. I, I, I got oranges. Got plenty of oranges. I got loads of oranges. This is what they're like, I want lemons! And it's like, yeah, well, you see, the thing about lemons is we they don't exist. Not a miss game, anyway. Okay, that there, that there, this here. That there, that there, this here. That there, and that there. And all we need now are three more. One, two, three. Put that there. Do that. That. And we're just gonna wrap these up. And then we gotta find some clothes to wear. This is very important. Gotta find something fancy. There we go. A few more. So I hope you're all- there are 26 of you here, by the way. Which is amazing! I- I greatly appreciate you all being here. I spent all day yesterday eating so many oranges that got swole, so three more should break my record, but hurt! <sighs> Don't worry, I got this for you, Jitters. I've got all of... the oranges you could need. Do you have, like, 10,000? I'm like, okay, I don't have that many. So, I don't know what outfit I'm going to pick, but I do know one aspect of the outfit, and that is the glasses. Today, we're going to wear these glasses. Oh, 
Okay, I'm getting a vibe here. I'm getting some kind of vibe. Hmm. I don't know what it is, but I'm getting it. Okay. That's an option. That's definitely an option. Hmm. That's an even better option. But no, we'll go with cargo pants. We go with those pants, but no, cargo pants. And we need... Time to get swole! Well, wish granted, I can absolutely provide that. I can 110% get swole. It's very green. This is true, it is very green. Hmm. Hello there, how you doing? Hope you're doing well. You know what, I'm actually going to go with this. I don't know why, but I just feel like this kind of vibe today. I am nervous, apprehensive. Um, in a good way? I, I don't know yet. We'll see later on today in a few hours, or not. This apprehension may carry on all night. I don't know. We gotta get swole, though. Hey, hey, buddy. Oh, easy, Bela. There's a lot of people in the plaza today. Oh, wow, there's a lot of people in the plaza. That's like five people. Also, I think Margie's going to sit down in the plaza. And there's Sprocket being like, Zort, time for me to show off how swole I am. And then he immediately started to show off getting swole. So there we go. Get a little bit started here. And it's not that cold, but I imagine there is a bit of a, there is a bit of a wind, so dressing as I am makes sense. Robo bird. Yep. That's Sprocket. He's a robo bird. He joins uh, two other villagers in being robots. Uh, there's a frog robot, and then there's Cephalobot, who is a octopus robot. Ribot, I believe it is. Stop Tango, what's this here about dodos not being birds? <laughs> that, it wasn't me that said it, Alias. You are surrounded by nooklings. Every time they lean next to you, they tell you the upcoming... I mean, the upcoming Amazing Sale is turning up soon. That is true. It's a great time to buy stuff. It's a great time to buy stuff. Alright, here we go. Last little bit. Then we've got to start giving out gifts galore. Every single villager is just going to scatter to the winds. Oh yeah, harps are really expensive. But they're worth getting. Alright, quickly. Oh, there are so many people in the plaza today! Or around the plaza, they're all gonna scatter. Okay, is Ma Margie is going over there. She is. Greetings! Nice to see you! Got a gift for you, Margie. For me, really? Yep, you asked for oranges? I have oranges. Better have some right now. Oh, this is great! Get some oranges! Thanks, that's awful of you. Here, I want you to have my doctor's coat. It 
can maybe diagnose what I think maybe the follow-up of the toot was. What's up, Tootie? Because we now have two verbs. One says Zort and the other says Bazert. They're very similar. Have you noticed that suspicious bird anchored on the northern shore of the island, Tootie? I never thought a bird could look untrustworthy. Until now! Aww. Allentown is going to get oranges? Awesome! Hello, Lord Typhon. Gold! You're breaking it! I am! I got a gift for you, too. What? Wow, for me, Bazert? Yep. Would you like... Thing! I think I'm blocking the way towards the, uh... Chairs. I got over it now! I can't wait! Some oranges are delicious right about now! Thanks! I'll leave you later. Here's something for you! Some monochromatic tile flooring! Take it up, we shy! Thank you very much, Jenners. We'll just quickly get out of the way, so that Margie can get to us. Um, what's going on, Bazert? Just one chat. I just got called tedious by Weber. He said I only ever think about my muscles. I just said that it was like when I was shirts, I like when I shirts drinking the wash because it helps you chop my abs, Bazert. Oh, look at him, he's staring at the bug. One thing about the ostriches, they are really, really fast. They're really fast. Look how quick they are. Also, he makes, like, robot noises when he moves. Hey, Ascentar! Great to see you! I enjoy how Margie finally admits the two force hat. <laughs> Seriously? You're right. What do you got? Yeah, but I don't think the two walls were as dramatic as you thought they were, Alias. I have to see what's inside. They're probably very playful and silly. This something tasty and then some oranges. Thanks! Thanks, I could eat for days. They're scary good, Yodelay. Well, right, here's something for me to you. It's one- No, Paula! Well, I saw it being a trend! Paula, no! Yeah, what's up, Yodelay? I've not prepared this! Alright, so a little bird who may or may not be a natural bird. Or a little. Told me something about you. I heard you're a fantasy way more than the comics, so is that true? It is. Ah, I loved fantasy when I was little. I just drifted off to other comics over time, you're late. It's cool to hear you're keeping that party going, though. Oh, no! They're all giving their photos over now. All of them. Hi there, Eeks. Just want to say hi. Don't you love being outside when the weather's like this? We need to have a picnic sometime. No way now, though. What's up, Jordan? Pets has been popsized together. I just want to chat. No way, no fair. You just come strolling on through wearing a mud parka. It's super mega mundo hard to pull up such a simple look, but here you are fully rocking it. You're so charismatic. Be careful with that superpower. I promise never to use it for evil, okay? Can't promise anything. I see that you're uh, still sat down, buddy. What was we like? It's like, I don't know, and I don't. It's like, I don't know, I'm gonna be lost my opportunity to get the diet 60. Aww. Yo, is there? You see, pipes as always? I'm, I'm just here to say hi. Night 60 fishes? I don't know. Maybe that's a percentage of fishes? Okay, I need to hope that kid sits up at some point. Oh, he's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. Buddy, you, you, gotta, you gotta sit up. He's thinking about it. Come on, buddy. I know you like coffee. No. Come on, buddy. You know you wanna. Oh, there's Toby. Ribbon, I was hoping to run to you. Got a gift for you, buddy. Seriously, for me? Yep. Would you like. Thing! Now what do we have here? They're all coming to me today! Ooh, could you hear my tummy rumbling? Is that why you got me these oranges? Just gonna tuck that away for five minutes from now. Look at the kid in the background. Well, we're gonna give me something this good for free. Do you have anything decent to give you? Haha! How would you feel about a sour jumpsuit, eh? I mean, sounds cool! Oh, he's getting up! What, I was hoping to run to you! 
I mean, you definitely weren't hanging around or something. Oh, for real? Yep. Here's Thing! Ooh, can't wait to open this. Ooh, could you hear my tummy rumbling? Is that why you got me these oranges? I'm just gonna tuck that away for five minutes from now. I can't let you walk away and hand it off so generous to me. Here, you gotta take an elephant slide, okay? I mean, it's not a photo, but, uh... It's okay. Hey, what you have to do? What? Just wanna say hi? Okay, let Dr. Kim describe the perfect activity for group activity of friends. Going for an amusement, going to the amusement park! I really like how upfront they are. The promised amusement is literally a part of the name! And don't even get me started about the snacks! I just sold myself, what? I mean, you sold yourself, but, uh, pfft, he just sat back down. He sold himself, but, uh, spoiler alert, I'm just gonna refill on this liquid fireball. By the way, my mouth is literally ablaze! Also, my parents, still, after all these years, not realizing that I have a work schedule. I'm going, hey, we're gonna talk, try and pester you during your work? And I'm like, yeah, I mean, that's not gonna work, because I'm just gonna focus on my work. Like, no, mother, I cannot just drop everything and talk to you now. You're going to have to wait for an hour and a half. Minimum. Like, I will send you one message, but if you're expecting a conversation, you're not going to get it. You're going to get me sending one message to you. And then they'll try and ring me or something, and I will just ignore them. Because, unfortunately... I... Oh, oh, hang on. I need to be back. That is an important phone call. One moment. It's, uh, I'm back, sorry, it was about the things. Basically, I will know one way or another tomorrow, apparently. So I will, th it, it, it is to the point where the other side are going, we need tonight to talk about it. It's like, they need tonight to talk and decide about it, and I will know in the morning, tomorrow. Either yes, or no. And if it's no, then it's no, if it's yes, then it's panic time. It, it, it is 110% panic time if it is yes. That is when, as people say, things get serious. Alright, we can do that, Threatland. Thank you. That is when things get serious. I apologize that little things about my actual life are bleeding into streams. Oh yeah, it'll be absolutely 110% panic time. I mean, it'll be panic time, especially if it doesn't work out, because then there'll be a lot of money and a lot of expense, and I'll just lose it. And I'll be like, yay! <laughs> yeah, that'd be terrible if that happened. I see Kid has now moved over to that. 
I mean, making a life-changing financial decisions is worthy. It is, but that's the thing. I can, it can be accepted, and it can still go horribly wrong, and I could end up not with a house, and still massively out of pocket. This could happen. But the fact that they're, they're taking all that time to think about it, says that they're really considering it. Uh, the fact of the matter is that uh, our offer was the only offer on the table. It was the only offer on the table, and another two weeks went by, and there were no other offers. So we were the only people actually, we're the only people actually making an offer. So in the end, it's like, here is our offer. This is what we can, the max we can afford. And so, if you don't want to go for that, that's fine. We'll just walk away. Do not worry. Uh, there would be many people with legal expertise looking over the things. Yeah, some people will. And you know what? If they want to they want to do that, that's fine, but uh, I'm not playing that game. I'm not playing that game. I have a limit, a hard line in the sand, and I can't go over it. So if they say no, I've just got to go, sorry. Hello, Timmy. Hello, Tommy. You've not told me about fantastic sales. This is true. There are no fantastic sales going on just yet. Okay. Got that. Like, if they don't want... it's They are fully... The, the people who own the house are fully within their rights to not sell to us. And that's fine. They don't have to. But... We're not going to budge further. It's like, that's it. It's like, we cannot... So... There we are. That is the situation that it be. As it were. And we'll see what happens. Apparently I'll know... Oh, he's found a bug. Apparently I'll know by tomorrow. The fact that they're thinking about... Like, the fact that they're thinking about it is a good sign. The fact that... I understand exactly why the sales guy is being as the sales guy is. Because the sales guy... The, oh. He's found a little bug. Oh! Buddy, that's not where the bug was. The bug was over there. Ah. Oh. Poor jitters. But, uh, the sale person wants to get their commission. Which is understandable, so they're working as hard as they can. And... Yay! Important stuff! Hey, 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 Duck! Sense Duck, why? Thanks for coming by. Always good to see you. You should stop talking about house stuff and you think give me oranges because I'm hungry. Huh? Do we get something? You do! You get oranges, sir. The only ones are for Boris and Bella now. How do I see inside? I'm gonna open it. Some oranges, yummy! It looks good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oi, Saint Star! I'm gonna leave the floor and eat that. I'm not even sure with the bugs. Yeah, man, it's some dark block flooring. Enjoy, choir. Yep. The, did you only just notice the jitters drum? What's new, choir? You only just noticed that. Look at me. I'm all dressed up. Is it my retro sweater real neat? I try not to eat too much when I get dressed up like this. Stains are fashionable, Qua. We're probably already rented to the property for one dollars for three years to a nephew the day before Cyber Circle Talk. Leave it to people buy the property with a legal Qua. Oh. Oh. Oh, that would be terrible. But I don't think anything like that's going to happen. See, I, I, I slip in little bits of, like, jitters everywhere. Bit of jitters all over the... Like, there's jitters right there, and there's there's jitters on music things, and... It's all there. It's all, it's all subtle. 
Then the where was like, Pico could just move in with me, quite I mean, if I could move into digital real space, that would be an interesting thing. But uh Unfortunately, buddy, much as I'd like to be able to just move into digital real space, I unfortunately cannot. I have to live in this pesky thing called the real world. Also, there's going to be a lot of work going into this garden shortly. I don't, work. I don't know why I... Oh, I didn't dig it back up, that's why. Should have really dug it back up. Chad is not all it's cracked up to be, save for Digimon. I mean... Digimon does have that one day that you could always just announce is that day on Twitter. It has at least that Mei Mei going for it. That classic Mei Mei. I don't even know what the day is, because I've never watched the movie, but I know that that joke is there. I know it is a thing that exists. I'm trying to remember what day it is. So I never really watched the show. I never really watched um, the Pokemon show either. I was a bit too old when that happens. Well, that happened rather. Uh oh. Hey, Sandy, I'm looking all over for you. Remember how you wanted a baby robot? No. Well, I got one for you. Uh, no, I, I don't actually. You didn't tell me you wanted one of these? Snort, come on, brain, I'm counting on you. Oh, well, take it anyway. I don't want it. Oh, well, that's my good deed for the month. <laughs> that's not a good deed, buddy. Sum it up. That is going straight in the bin. Hope you have something to give me, or at least I'll sell it. I will sell it. I'll do you that, that favor, Boris. Well, then, might as well get to a rapid. Some oranges. Smells darn good, too. I'll give us some milk and home. In my belly. Hey, not free, Miss Walt. So, as a thank you, have an Astro dress. Doesn't go with the baby romper, but you know. Sum it up. Just want to say hi. What do you think? Just trying out my vampire costume. Suits me if I say so myself. Now, I don't know about you, but you're definitely not running over to the shop to sell the baby romper right now, are you? I am, in fact. No, I don't need to do that. I have an express emergency baby romper disposal pipe that takes me immediately to the shop that will allow me to sell the baby romper. There. Now nobody can thought bubble and ask for the baby romper because you know someone will. Polo will be like... Never forget, unfortunately, what Boris fulfilled the baby romper promise. No! No! <sighs> And also, congratulations, Thrithfield. That sounds like a uh, an excellent uh, thing to have happen. That is officially the name of the pipe now. I don't even remember what the name of the pipe was, and I just said it two minutes ago. Someone's going to buy that and give it back to you. The cycle will continue. Well, at least I delay it somewhat. I stole it. Alright, let's go over here. Something like the express- Oh! The express baby remo- Like, uh, baby romper removal pipe. Boris said that Sandstar wanted it, and Boris wouldn't lie. Yeah, but Boris's memory is about as, like, retentive as a sieve. A sieve with holes two inches wide. He believes he invented a game called Rump, called uh, Jumpy Ropey. Like, I don't think he invented a game called Jumpy Ropey. Also, speaking of, of ropes, not at all speaking of ropes, time to go talk to our good friend Marcel. We do need to sort out the interior of Marcel and Sprocket's homes. 
Sister, and what's your step okay? What you doing? I'm making me a sauna heater. One of the bugs in the floor was in the DOA structure in my ear while I was sleeping last night. So I gotta jump build it before I even forget what it is. What? You already know how to make a sauna heater? I do. That's real cool. You're always on top of things, and I'm usually stuck under them. I want to tell everybody about the sauna heater, so I scribbled down the recipe. If you allow what, know anybody who wants to know how to make it, can you hand them this note? And maybe apologize for the cookie grease as much in the middle part. That's no problem, buddy. I like cookies. I can go for some of them right now. It'd be great if a bunch of folks made a sauna heater. It would be. Hey, what's going on? Just want to say hi. Sensta, when's it snack time? Which snacks do you go for? Ooh, chocolate. I was thinking the same thing! That's why we're gonna be snap buddies forever and ever! I mean... I could agree with that logic. If he likes chocolate, that sounds good. It's interesting that there are... Have you seen Inks yet? We've seen her, but we haven't been able to give her a gift yet. Why? She's uh, sat in the plaza. Like, the fun part is, is that there is dialogue that is unique to having not full friendship. There is some dialogue that is no longer accessible when you attain a high friendship rating with a villager. Which is interesting. There's o there's dialogue that only they will say... That they'll only say when you are at lower friendship, but they don't know you as well. There are things up here that I haven't grabbed yet. Are we going to be so busy today? But I think I can manage it. Especially considering the fact that we're pretty much nearly done with all the uh, downstairs stuff. Or all the uh, ground floor stuff. No, not even ground floor. Sea level stuff. The, the term you're looking for, Kiko, is sea level. By the way, you can order more than one uh, pair of pipes. You can have like three pipes or four pipes. But you cannot determine which pipe goes where. If you have more than two pipes, which one you arrive out of is random. And you can put one in your house and just use that to get back into your house. This is a thing you can do. Hey there! Welcome to Mrs. Bo's self made lovely by Claw. Thank you! Like, you can have one that is literally from the interior of your house into the plaza. You know the tapestry hanging on my left wall over there? It belonged to our mother. Every time I look at it, I get this one feeling inside. Like, would you want to hug me? Always makes me a little sad to hear. Hey, pretty room, go right ahead. Uh, I don't know if it works. Like, I don't know if it works the same way. I, I think it only works within your house. I haven't tried, honestly. Oh, no, let me cut your eye. Afraid not. Thanks. Please come again. I will. Like, I haven't tried to put a warp pipe in a villager's home. That, by the way, is a special item I believe I can still order. Um, yeah, I can still order them because uh, I bought them all at the time. I want to say, but it doesn't work. I bet Wikipedia would tell me. Or Nookipedia, rather. Wikipedia wouldn't tell me. Imagine if Wikipedia went, Well, we have catalogued this. And we have put it in our, like, notes of critical importance about Animal Crossing New Horizons. Get the feeling they have slightly more important things to do. They probably do. There is that boat we will be checking. You tr you tried it. I, I'm i inclined to believe you. It would make sense for it not to work in a villager's home. Because you're always allowed to access your home. Villager homes, however, it's very much dependent on if they're in and if they're up. Oh, it probably is. Oh yeah, it's it's likely a massive, massive thing. It's mostly community driven, I think. I think curating it is mostly community driven.
All right, we need to grab all... Actually, no, we can make a bit of space first before we grab everything. Because we can put away all of this. Then we need to grab all this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Five. Excellent. And then that goes, and then this. Oh, we got loads of space, actually. Oh, no, it's... I find it to be pretty reliable. It's just it gets bigger. Like, the amount of information that is on the site is always getting larger. And as something gets larger, it gets harder to deal with. Like, it's just the sheer volume of stuff. Like, what is the limit of human knowledge? There is... Is there a limit? No, not really. We're always discovering new things. New events are always happening. And they get catalogued and they get put down and... Yes. It's very good as a starting point for you to go and find other research. It's a good initial jumping point. Good so that you can know what you need to look for and where you need to look for it. It could also sometimes be good for just getting info. Well, if it isn't my favorite cousin, glad to have you aboard Jolly Red's treasure trawler. Oh, so policy, you know it, I know it. I have a limit of one art piece per customer per day. Choose wisely. All right, that's real. That's always real. I don't think that's real. That's real! Now, the way you can tell if that's real is where the guy in the background's hand is. I'll, I'll show you. So... That one's hand is right there. Never did, oh, are they all real? That does happen. There is a 10% chance that every single one is real. So real, real, real. I think they're all real. I think we have a, a... Yeah, I think we have all four real ones. I'm also buying this mop. Let the best punk albums is possible to get enough of a mop. I mean, your words not mine. Tell you what, just because of my favorite fall weather out there. Yours for 1,230. But she lacked jewelry in the original. Ah, so it's probably fake then. Yes, that's the right choice. I'll just take those bells from you. Yeah, what the... Oh, did they put the jewels on later? As in... Oh, the statue is fake. Yeah, I thought it was. The little kid could know the red isn't real. Oh, we're buying this one, by the way. Oh, well, I have an awful lot of points been asking me about buying that painting there. But maybe the price scared them off, so... I'll send you 4,980 bells. Deal with this, the fall. You win? I, I want it. Ha! You're not going to regret this. I'll just get those bells from you. Give it all that. Congratulations, you're now the proud owner of a solemn painting. Been a pleasure doing business with your cousin. I'll get your art packed up and shipped out tomorrow. Fun fact, the first piece of art that he sells you, like the very first piece before he uh, starts selling art on his trawler, always real. 100% real. You won't regret it. Thank you very much. So, if you get a really... Are you interested in a trade? I mean... What paint? What picture do you want? What, you want that painting? I take it that's the painting you're looking for. What if I actually have... Yeah, I wonder if I actually...
actually have one of those. I might already have one. Let me have a look. Uh, still missing it. Uh, it's a wall-mounted one, isn't it? Hang on. I already have one. That's my second solemn painting spare. So yeah, we can absolutely sort something out. I already have one. It is absolutely a good day to know somebody that hoards a ton of art. I mean, honestly, tomorrow I could just we could just find a time for you to pop over and you could just, I could just give it to you. Like, it really doesn't matter. Like, the only thing I would want, if you have one, which I don't think you do, is a natural and green sombrero. But if you don't have one, that's fine. Because honestly, you'd just be saving an inventory space in my storage by taking it off me. It's got a lollipop. It's all right, if you don't have it, you can still have the art, I mean. There is a bird. But yeah, even if you don't have it, you can still have the art. It's only just going to languish in my storage otherwise. At least with you, it'll it'll have a purpose. I mean, honestly, what other pieces of art don't you have? Because I might have a few of them. We could sand start just helping out being a patron of the arts. <sighs> just got a. The old annoying thing, it's got a voicemail here. Uh, I want to get rid of the voicemail. I suppose the. Okay, what you have to do to get rid of the voicemail notification is you need to... Literally, the solemn painting is... Well, we could absolutely sort that for you tomorrow. Ooh. Ooh. Oh dear, pardon me. Why, hello, Sandstar. Welcome to the Hills Farm Museum. How may I be of service? I'd like to assess some fossils. Who, what would you like me to assess? I'm all a flutter. We could absolutely double check, by the way, by going into the art exhibit and having a look at it. Well, it's daytime. Well, the one I see, let us take a closer look, shall we? He's an owl. He's a night creature. He wakes up at, uh, I believe, like five or six, and then he's up until the same time in the a.m. Isn't indeed quite splendid, but last time I see Brunetti has fossils such as these. I would be tempted to purchase these in my personal collection, but no, I must take such a up to two now. May I help you with anything else? No, I'm good. Jolly good. Please enjoy the rest of your visit. I will. Let's go to the art exhibit and double check that it's the real Medeal. I don't know what a real Medeal is, but uh, there we go. Uh, it's not there. It's not there. It's there. Yep, see? Yep, hand out. It's the real thing. So yeah, I bought the real one. I already have another one. Just, you know, a second one of the painting. Just sitting around. 
might build a Gumpler today. I'm feeling in a sort of build a Gumpler kind of mood. I don't know, it's just just feeling Gumplery. Or at least getting part way to building a Gumpler. I think I have to paint part of one, but uh, I could do that. Hello, you! I was hoping I'd see you today. Can I have some coffee? It's two hundred a cup. Sure thing! Sure. Now, uh, now that Annalise is gone and everybody's starting to hand over their photos, you know what you gotta do. You wanna keep the luck going, you gotta drink the coffee hot. A Rubik's Cup special for you. Drink up, cool. Nah, it's too hot. I see you want the luck to run dry, do ya? Well, on your head be it, cool. On your head be it. Do -do 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 -do. It's the Isabella when it's cooled a little bit. Or a lot. Or completely. Cool. Thank you very much. Alright, all we have to do now is sell what's in our inventory, put up the photo, and get a few things done. And then we're on to sorting out gardens and home interiors and everything else. It'll be good. We have a lot of stuff in our inventory. I've also got to double check that I still have Paula's photo. Uh, small. If I've sold it, I don't know what I can do about that. Yep, there it is. Oh, it's such a lovely photo. It's a very nice photo. Don't put it in your inventory now. That is a really bad idea, Kiko. Do not put it in your inventory now. Put it in your inventory when you have sold everything. That's a mop. Okay. Honestly, I'm just going to sell everything that's in my inventory right now. That isn't the mop. Even that uh, rare mushroom, because they're already using one recipe. You already have the solemn? You do? Which one don't you have, then? Which painting don't you have? Because it sounds like there's one you don't have, it's just a question of which one. Uh, you can save them, there's no harm in saving them, Tom Tom. Like, it's a good idea to have uh, multiple of something. They aren't common, no, but they're not used used a lot of- I can- I can get you the seasonal recipes, and I can show you what it's used for. In a moment, I can show you. Let's get the recipe list off and have a look. Okay, so. Recipe list. Seasonal. Uh, round mushroom. Skinny. Flat. Skinny. Flat. Skinny. Round skinny flat. Elegant round skinny flat. Elegant round skinny flat. Rare for the forest flooring. Round skinny flat. Skinny and flat. So the only thing it's used for is the forest flooring. And you only need one. The one between the warm painting and the glowing painting. You know what? We can go have a look at that in a moment. We can go have a look at that. We can, we can find out which one it is. Let me go check for you. I mean, we've got time. We've got, what, 40 minutes? Pretty sure I can do a uh, two house interiors and a garden in 40 minutes. Do 30 minutes. 
And we don't need to do the home interior super desperately. So, far right, between the warm and the glowing painting. That's the glowing painting. Oh! And that's the warm painting. So it's this painting! The worthy painting! You know that's in my... That's in... That's in red storage right now. That's in his shop right now. I can't buy it, but you could come and buy it. Like, you could come and buy that on my island. You don't have to do it on the stream, we can wait until after the stream. If you prefer, but... That could be done today. Like, you could just come and buy the painting. I mean, how long would you need? So we need to change this. Put this up, and then we'll start thinking about renovate or working on those home interiors. Actually, no. Work on the garden first. Then if you have time, Kiko, do home interiors. It was natural green. Yes, natural green. That's right. Naturally green. It's one of two sombreros. I mean, you don't have to trade me the sombrero. Like, you don't have to trade me the sombrero. I know sombreros are not easy to come across. Like, honestly, I think I have just that painting. I think I just have that painting, just in storage. Ooh, for that, it's one of the paintings I don't actually have a copy of spare. But that's okay. Like, you could go and get it. Like, you could come get it. That's absolutely fine. It's there to be grabbed. It's, it's only going to disappear if I don't. Um, in the meantime, while you're, like, sorting stuff out, let me just at the very least think about getting started with Sprocket's Garden. And that involves getting rid of all the sand. Get rid of all this sand. Okay. That. And that. Take a long time it took me to complete my museum. And I got a lot of help from uh, Hammy and her time-traveling shenanigans. I got a lot of help from Hammy and her time-traveling shenanigans.
But it did take me a long time. When it's completed is the joy. Once the museum is completed, that's it. The museum is done. Like, it's good. It, it's done. It's completed. Also, I want to leave that one spot there. So I know where the fence starts and ends. The robot needs a thing that goes doink. Uh, right, let me go quickly get some wall. Need to quickly go get some walls. And we need to think. What walls do I give him? Hmm. Um. Honestly, I usually just go with these walls for him. Very solid walls. I like the block fencing. It needs something all casual. Are you, you implying that it needs a giant pipe organ? I mean, I, I've never known you to want to give anyone a giant pipe organ. You can do it today if you have time. Absolutely. I'm sure we can find time to do it today, Mr. Megahasi. If not in the stream, then sometime after the stream. Sounds like a good plan. Then we can finish off your art exhibit. this. Actually, saying about all that, we actually want here a little stone area. See why in a bit. Okay. Okay. Put all these here. I don't remember what color flowers Sprocket likes. I think he likes orange. Mm. Orange might be a little tricky. But I think I can make orange work. Finish that. You can hear that cricket, by the way. Hear that cricket chirping away. Dressable spot for singing. You can even go. I know that I'm in a rush, but at the same token, gotta catch this. Oh, look how happy he is. I can't imagine. Though some people also do it frequently, but won't touch on myself. Maybe I mean, some people like doing it, other people don't. No. Thinking about his upcoming years. I mean, all he's got to do is hand over his photo. Yeah, I enjoy it. Like, it's one of the things I like. I like the the routine of it. I like. 
knowing that, like, in a couple of days, it'll be my birthday on an in real life and Animal Crossing. It'll be, like, a double birthday. Get to celebrate my birthday there. Green, orange, or his preferred colours. Okay, green and orange. We, we can work with that. We can work with green and orange. You work with green and orange. Now we know what we have on this. Protein shake. Actually, no. Let's move this over to here. His birthday's in December, too. Yeah, it is! Isn't that handy? We'll actually be able to celebrate his birthday. So then we put... Guitar here. Many flowers. I, I think he's uh, not so much a flower guy, but he absolutely needs a little exercise workout place there. I have a few flowers here. So his birthday. All right, let's let's get fifteen bits of iron. I am shockingly close to being done with this guy's garden. Always fun to celebrate birthday, indeed. Oh, Amelia, I do like her a lot. I do like her a lot. Okay, do I have any like workout stuff left? Did I get rid of all of it? I might have. Um, I think I did. But that's okay. Because I was, you know, making space. Oh yeah, I got rid of, like, everything. That's okay. We can make stuff for it. Just give me some iron. Also, give me... One of those rare mushrooms. Because I have a lot of them. If I give me two. If we sell those, I can get 20,000. That'll be enough to do my renovations. That'll be enough to do the renovations. Okay. Ooh, they're worth 16 grand each. That's a lot of money. Alright, anyway. Could have just got one of them, really. But that's okay. Clears out inventory space. Gets me one step close to finishing off his garden. I'm doing surprisingly well at sorting everything out here. I like being so on the ball with stuff. Just need to find a couple of flowers, and I think I can get him a couple of nice flowers. Right. Craft. Let's get him... A barbell. And a kettlebell. We got much swole on the island right now. We have Paula with her little exercise area, we have Jitters with his exercise area, and we have Sprocket with his exercise area. And each of them is their own different person because, you know, Paula's a sisterly, 
and Sprocket has the music hobby. Okay, better plan. Better plan. There we go, that's a lot better. Now I just need a couple of orange flowers. I think I know where to find some. Bingo. Right here. Wasp nest, of course. Like, Bleh! you just get assailed. I'll even water these to get some more. Quickly, we got all this sorted. Yeah! Oh, I can't catch anything! Oh, poor you. Right, let's put away this kettlebell, just in case I end up using it in the future. And... He's just having a dance! See, that's why I like Music Hobby Villagers, you just walk past them and they're just having a whale of a time dancing. It could be chucking it down with rain and they'll just be dancing away without a care in the world. It's what they do. Hi, buddy. Huh? Ah, Senta! Hello, hello! This is the construction consultation counter. How can I help you, hmm? I'd like to talk about homes. Of course, of course! Let's talk about them. We can discuss your home or suggest signs for one of our other residents. Which would it be? I'd like to talk about residents' home. Oh! You'd like to pitch some new home designs to a resident? We can certainly arrange that. To get started, I'll need 9,000 miles of firm. That's a lot, so I'll give you some miles once the work's done. What do you think? What do you say? Hmm? You ready to brainstorm some, some ideas? Blah. Words. I am. Fantastic. Let's not waste any time. Who would you like to talk about redesigning the home? Please come me work on Sprocket first. Sprocket. Hmm. All right. Then uh, let's call him over and get his thoughts on the matter. Doot, doot, doot. And that about covers it. What do you think? You okay? Trust success that with your home. If that's what's up, then bring it on! I trust you to beef up my house good and proper, Zort! Oh, glad to hear it! Your house is in good hands. Leave everything sense down on me. Look how happy he is. And look how shiny he is. Yes, yes! Now that everyone's on board, I just need to grab my 9,000 bell for you. We'll start. Now then, did you want to start the home's interior or exterior? Uh, let's go interior, please. Oh, got it! We'll work on the interior. I'd like to imagine Sprocket's home. You have to clear your mind, or we each describe all the ideas you have for its interior. Alright, let's get down to business. Tell me what you have in mind for Sprocket's home. Let me know when you're done, or if you'd like to work remodeling the home's exterior. Alright, this isn't going to be a, a very big one. Is that a... That is the world's tiniest carpet there. No, it's the... That's actually not a carpet. That's a... That's a chip. Okay, so. 
Let's instead get him somewhere he can sit. Because he has nowhere he can sit right now. Let's get him somewhere where he can put stuff. Where are the tables? You could! But I want to keep things relatively simple. There are no such chairs, I'm afraid. They do not exist. Where is what I'm looking for? There it is. The thing you gotta watch out for is that his house is very, very bad for, like, general navigation. That would be better. They may be, but that doesn't mean to say that there is a uh, thing for them. This is a big house. It's got a lot of stuff on it. A lot of stuff in it. Uh, rugs. Some ideas for lights. Rather wall mounted stuff. It is indeed. It is indeed KK Metal. He does like his metal. I think that's a good little addition. We just need to make sure he can get everywhere. Still access everything. Excellent. Yeah, now it's a fancy place. I like it. What am I gonna do for you? I'm done! Yeah. Okay, I'm ready to plan the exterior model if you are. Did you just make it dimmer so you couldn't see what you were, what you actually did? Nope. But nope as well? Understood. Everything's ready. Great work! We're actually probably going to do a lot to Marcel's house. I quite like Marcel's interior. 
Thanks again for your hard work, Sandstar. I know which pitch is going to go over great with Sprocket. You've done your part, now it's time for you to do mine. How about with Sprocket so we can start? Everything should be just as we talked about by tomorrow. Be sure to drop by and see how it came out. This is the construction consultation counter. How can I help you, hmm? Let's talk about homes again. Of course, of course, let's talk about them. We can discuss your own home as just as science for the other residents. Which would it be? Well, we'd like to talk about a residence home. We'd like to, yep, work on that. And... Marcel. So long, Trayton. Yes, please. Let's get the lucky rest of the so we can get started. And that about covers it. What do you think, UK? Trusting your side stop with your home? Sounds good, you may ears. There's no way I've seen your winter summer remodeling my place. Oh, oh, glad to hear it. Your house is in good hands. Leave everything to side stop me. Yeah. Sort of visible walls in this house. That would be like that. Yes, yes, now whenever everyone's on board, we should collect 9,000 mil for you to start. Now then, what did you want to, uh, on the home's interior? Um, yep, interior, please. Work on the interior, yep. And Marcel's home, we will indeed imagine it. Once it's clear in our mind, we will indeed describe the ideas we have for the interior. We shall do that. Alright, let's get down to business. Tell me what you have in mind for Marcel's home. Let me know if you're done, if you'd like to work with remodeling the home's exterior. There's really not a lot I want to do to this. Like, I want to add a, a light. I also probably want to move this fish. So now he actually has access to the place where he can, you know, dance and sing. Uh, I want to add a light fixture. I also want to add some food to that table. Mm, I can add some food to that table. What do we want? Um... Hmm. Mm -mm. What's that coming straight from the amazing restaurant on Paradise Planning? Mm, is that food? Delicious food! Look at that! It's just scrummy! Food like you've never imagined food. Now I'm hungry again. You saw that and you're hungry? Oh dear. I was so sorry. No, I don't want that. Um... Do I want? Do I want anything there? Maybe a plant. Plants are nice. Um. Hmm. Okay, I know what I want. Let's get a bamboo stool. Let's put on the bamboo stool a little bonsai tree. Oh, it looks like someone will have to visit Sports Ball 80. What's wrong with the food? food! Okay, fine, I'll, I'll get rid of the food. Give me a different food. Honestly. What's wrong with the food? Ha! 
How about instead an extravagant meal? How about that? Does that look better? I think it looks much better. It does actually. Yeah, I thought it would because it's actually food. Yeah, but I like it being extravagant. It's got a little bit of everything. By one, huh? I don't think there's anything like rugged-wise that I could put there that would work, huh? Actually, honestly, I think this little improvement makes it a lot better, because like you can access this to sing at. You've got this here. You can still get to here. You've got a little thing there. You've got this. You can sit there with your food. Actually, you know what? Let's make the two foods different. Let's make the foods different. That's exactly the same, it's just a different uh, thing. Let's have... No! Let's have that! Oh yeah, that's perfect! I like it. I like it. I think we're good. I don't think there's much else I wanted to really change. Hey, what can I do for you? I'm good. I'm, I'm quitting. No, 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 I'm good. Okay, I'm ready to plan out the exterior model if you are. Nope. Understood. Everything's ready then. Great work. Thanks, buddy. Thanks again for your hard work, Sandstar. You've done your part, now it's time for you to do mine. I'll keep work with ourselves we can start. Everything should be just like the way we talked about it tomorrow. Be sure to drop by and see how it came out. I will! Now we just gotta say... Hello to both of them and talk to them about their stuff. We also need to make sure we give a gift over to Bella. So, there you are. Marcel is in his home, so we can absolutely find him there. It's just Sprocket we need to track down. It's just Sprocket. I remember where Sprocket is. He is maybe here. I think he's getting fish made my huge balding muscles, Zort! Uh, uh, maybe? Take me out! I'm gonna catch the biggest, baddest fish on the island, Zort! Yo! I'm so pumped that you thought of a design for my place. There's no way I'm turning another sofa down. As long as I have space to work out, I'm open to all your ideas. Let her rip, Sandstar! Yeah, about those, uh, that space. I mean, I, there's some space. There's absolutely some space. Yo! Alright, buddy. Let's talk your house. And how fancy it is. And how fancy it will be. Hey, thanks a bunch of pitching time with the idea of remodeling my place, and stuff. A lot of folks get real weird enough if somebody didn't live in their house trying to remodel it. Not me! Because I know you've got great taste, and let me tell you, I want my place to be extra tasty. Thanks, buddy. I may have moved his uh, speakers so that he can't actually hear them. If that's the case, I'll end up, uh, well, the when he's crafting. If that's the case when he's crafting, I'll end up redesigning his house slightly so that that's not the case. But hey, you know what? We did a lot of good stuff here. We did a lot of very, very neat things. And it's all good. Just gotta wait for you now, Bella. 
Yeah, no, I'm just sat here talking to my bestie. Okay, that's Margie. Yeah, she's smug right now because we're besties. We, it's good that we're besties because we've been living on this island for years, Eeks. So many people come, so many people go, but you know what? We're still here together on the island and that's what matters. You, me, Boris, and Jitters. And Kitty. You're not meant to talk about Kitty, Tootie. Oh, and, and just the four of us and you, Sandy. Yep. Only four. Did I get away with it? No, don't think you did. Dang it. And we never spoke about her. Until she eventually moved onto the island and all was Blair. I'm just kidding. Looking forward to when she gets to be on the island. I'm looking forward to it. A lot. Alright. What I need to do right now is just find someone to... I'm just kidding. I know exactly who we're raiding because, uh, it was mentioned who we were raiding. And that's Dezibus. So let's, uh, sort that out. Get that set up all ready to go. See, I remembered. I remembered. One moment. I'm not let you sitting up for like another two and a half minutes, eeks. If I don't make that like two minutes. Yep, two minutes. You can PM me later? I, I will. I will, don't worry. I, I've just got to sort a few things out and maybe have dinner and then I we can get it all done, Mr. Megahasi. I do apologize if we didn't get around to it today, but uh... Or rather, right now. We will get around to it today. It's just a question of doing it on the stream. But we'll definitely get it done. You need that thing. You need that thing. So many messages about things. Alright. There we go. Yeah, we gotta do... We, we gotta dance. Now I do this. If I do it from here, though. Oh, only one of them sees it. Okay, only one of them sees it. <laughs> you have to do little dances. It's very silly. Hello, Bella. Hello, Margie. I'm literally just waiting for Bella to stand up. It's 30 seconds now. Come on. You can do it, Bella. You can stand up. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. That's the fun of figuring it out, Eeks. You don't know if I'm gonna do it. I might stay here forever. This will be my new home. I'll be super fab celeb. Bella. No. See, I can do it. I can just sit here all day. You know the KK Slide is on television in like five minutes. Wait, five minutes? Oh no, I gotta go get ready. Hey, so what are feeling about you again today? Good thing too, because I was right here. Oh, what is it? You know what it is, Bella, before we go. It's fruit! Welcome to me, I'm going to sing while I hope on it. So I just jump. I ain't gonna read so fast, it's gonna be rude. Thanks a bunch. Hey, I wanna say thanks, I would like an object. It's a toy box, enjoy! Oh, she's singing! I can't walk away while she's singing! Oh! 
Tu que pille, tu que pille, Yo. Okay, now I have to go and put this away. And unfortunately, bid you all an adieu. For we have reached the end of the stream time. And I must thank you all absolutely for being here. Because you are all absolutely amazing and fantastic and brilliant and wonderful. And I couldn't do what I do without you. And I wouldn't want to do what I do without you. You are the reason that I can do what I do. And you are all absolutely fantastic and wonderful. And there are a couple of things I need to quickly talk about before we conclude. Starting off with my website, kikoroski.com. There is uh, lots of stuff there, including my schedule. You can read Tony Dust Lobby. You can also find links where you can buy my book and hope. Then there is my Discord, where you can join a large and thriving community, which I'm often a part of. There's lots of ways to talk about stuff, loads of remote space and let's space and streams past and present, no problem specialist. And if you link your Twitch and Discord together and your sub to on Twitch, you can use the Twitch emotes on Discord, which is fantastic. Also, 26 of you here today. That, that is amazing. You know what else is fantastic? My Patreon, where you can pledge to support me in doing Ooh. what I do. A pouch of gold. Um, I mean, thanks. Uh, I mean, thanks for the stream. I, it could go to either, Tom Tom. Thank you ever so much. But uh, there's my Patreon, where you can pledge to support me in doing what I do. There's only Let's Play stream I sit up behind paywalls. But there's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes that you typically don't see, including but not limited to all the editing, compression, and test streams, and test recordings that makes everything that I do a reality. And those of you that do pledge to me in these trying times, make it all possible. Every little bit does count, regardless of how big or small it is. And those that do not only get a different coloured name on Discord or by deep and sincere thanks, you also get the ability to vote in upcoming playthroughs and the opportunity arises, which will be starting after the Evolution playthrough on Sunday ends. That'll be going in full swing. Then there is my YouTube channel, where you can check out all of my content. For the very first video I put up nearly 16 years ago, I'm so perfectly normal, I'm so old, to the most recent one that went up today and everything in between. There's over 10,000 videos, including all of my Twitch VODs as well, for the time being. They might switch to their own dedicated channel soon enough. And those of you that sub to me there, we get more ones that close to 100,000 YouTube subscribers, which would be absolutely fantastic. But generally, the more people like, comment, and subscribe, and engage with my content, and watch it, the better it'll do. And the better off, like, the whole situation will be, and the more content I can make. There's also my Twitter, where you can... Follow me to get notifications when I start streaming, and my Let's Play videos go live, and all kinds of random other stuff. There are other social networks that I am also on, like Mastodon, Instagram, and Blue Sky, as well as my page, my uh, sorry, my Discord community and my YouTube community tab. There's also the Throne Wishlist, where you can pledge towards gifts that bring me joy. At the moment, it's lots of stuff for an Imperial Guard, oops, all tanks army, but uh, who knows what it'll be in the future. It might be for things like furniture in the future, who knows, or like a microwave, we need a wave. Finally, there is me thanking all of you, because seriously, you are all absolutely fantastic and amazing and brilliant and wonderful, and I could not do what I do without you, and I wouldn't want to do what I do without you. You are the reason I can do what I do. You are the reason it's possible, and you're the ones I make the content for. You are just so absolutely fantastic and brilliant and wonderful, and just so supportive and kind and amazing, and the greatest community I could ever hope for. With your continued support, I'll be able to keep doing this for as many years as is possible. That is my hope, to just keep making content for as long as I can for all of you. And there may be some difficult decisions for me in the future, but I will endeavour to do what I can to keep making stuff for you all, because it's my job and I love doing it. So thank you all ever, ever so much. Seriously, thank you. Thank you so much, thank you. And whether it be morning, afternoon, or evening, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, and I hope you achieve everything that you set out to do. The next stream is tomorrow, 7pm GMT, Action 52. It'll either be a stream commiserating everything going terribly wrong with this effort to get a house, or it'll be a stream celebrating everything going right, and the inevitable panic that follows when you realise, oh boy, this is only the start of the journey. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later. And remember, be nice to each other, everyone, for if everyone is nice to each other, the world would be that much better a place. And we all want that, don't we? Well, I certainly do, and I hope you do too. Later.